Here we are, you can see that cloud cover in place, not a lot of moisture, we're seeing a high pressure system, but if we zoom all the way over to California, which if you're with us earlier at noon, uh, you saw all that video of people seeing mudslides and downed trees and flooded streets because of this. It's called the Pineapple Express. It's an atmospheric river and it picks up moisture from one spot and it launches it to another spot. So places like California, which usually doesn't see a lot of rain, is actually getting all of its moisture from Hawaii. And the reason why it's called Pineapple Express is because Hawaii is, of course, known for its pineapples. So it's getting all of that heat and moisture, carrying it on up and launching it into California. Now, once it does this, it's going to spin off a little area of low pressure. This is actually what's going to come towards us from Monday into Tuesday. Now, notice what happens. It's no longer attached to that big string of moisture. Instead, it's just a standalone storm system by the time we get to Sunday night. But once we get to Monday, it's going to get close enough to the Gulf of Mexico that it's going to start to drag up moisture from there. So California has been seeing rain on the matter of inches. We're only probably going to get about a quarter of an inch of rain out of this system, even though it's coming from California and even though its origins are still from the Pineapple Express. And along with all this, we get the warmth of California, so we get all the bonuses and very little of the drawbacks.